youth activities, a positive use of their free time, more of Jesus. When we survey people in this region and ask what is missing, those are things we hear over and over again. Young people need guidance. They need direction. They need Jesus Christ. Well, two men who wholeheartedly agree with that have invested their lives to provide all of the above are Tyler Sutton and Buck Sutton. And there's so many things we could talk about when it comes to today's teens and what they need. But let's start by talking about a once a year event that packs so much in just two days. And that is taking place next month and it's called Converge. And it's gonna be exciting, isn't it? Oh man, we are extremely excited, Jennifer, about what God is doing and trying to bring the, the body of Christ together. And uh, so it's not just bringing the youth groups together and, and teenagers together, but also adults and churches and ministries. Mm -hmm. So yeah, what the momentum that Converge has right now, we're extremely excited about. Wonderful. Tyler, talk a little bit about Converge 2016. Give me a, give me a snapshot of what's going to be. Yeah, the purpose of Converge is to bring the body of Christ together, no matter what ministry organization, no matter what denomination. We want to come together under the banner, uh, banner We Are One. And so this year, we're so excited to have the bands 10th Avenue North, I Am They, and Hawk Nelson. Um, we're going to be headlining this year for worship, ushering the kids into the throne room of God. And then we have uh, three speakers back. We have Billy Beecham, who's the founder of See at the Pole, Dave Edwards, and Todd Gongwer, um, who wrote the book Lead for God's Sake. He's a good friend of Urban Myers. And so really excited to have these guys as our keynote speakers. Then we have 30 workshops for the students to attend. Um, they're breakout sessions, very heavy on discipleship, really um, like how to present the gospel, how to you know, lead someone to Christ. How, what does it mean to be a godly man or a woman? Um, so yeah, we're excited about the, the workshops. And then also um, we have Operation Love Line, which is our big outreach. So really it's about coming together, learning, growing, worshiping together, and then taking what we've learned and going out and being Jesus hands and feet in the community. What an incredible package of things, you know, Teenagers love to have exciting opportunities. They love to have fun. And you guys do all that at Teens for Christ. But the thing I love about Converge is, like you mentioned, the discipleship. You know, these speakers, Billy Beecham, he's not going to give them some lighthearted talk. Mm -hmm. You select speakers that are really going to invest in these kids' hearts and lives, right? Bob? That's so true. You know, I mean, that's, that's one of the things we want to do with Converge is not to be an emotional uh, uh, meeting or just get them up, you know, uh, that way and where they're excited. Not that there's not going to be fun there, mm -hmm. but it is where, you know, it's not just those guys too. We got 30 other speakers coming in from all over the country um, to teach them how, to, how to, to present the gospel to their friends at school, you know, how to pray, how to study the word of God. So we're really excited about that. So we're targeting eighth grade on up. Is that correct on the age eighth wise? Eighth and twelfth grade. Why is it so important at this time in their life to feed them this kind of information? Well, you know, I, I really believe some of the decisions that are being made right now at that age, number one is most people accept Jesus Christ do so before they're 19 years of age. But also they're making decisions that forget about the future. They're making decisions if they're gonna minister to their friend tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So it's about, it's about today. If, if we can get them turned on about Jesus today, then they will make an impact because they have tremendous faith, they have tremendous energy, and then they, they just trust God like a child. And uh, so, and when you get that kind of movement with one person or a group of people, you know, if it's a youth group or a school, now you get some great things happening. I'm so thankful for programs like Teens for Christ and Converge because when I was growing up in high school, in Iowa, in a rural town, nobody was doing things like this. Mm -hmm. There maybe was a church night, but that was because you had to go. Right. You know, that was not the cool thing to do. Yet y here we have an event that's coming up. I mean, my eighth grade daughter is clamoring to go to this. Yeah. She wants to be there because she wants to hear what Billy Beecham has to say, right. you know? So I light a field house this year. Tell me a little bit about the uh, logistics and how people can sign up. Yeah, yeah, we moved to Elida Field. This is our first year there. Um, we outgrew the UNH Event Center last year. Um, around 1,000 people between students and adults. So we're really excited for what God's going to do here at a new venue, new location. Um, but convergemovement.com is our website. People can go there to find out all the information regarding tickets, all of our speakers, bands, workshops, Operation Love Lima. Um, that's going to be the easiest way to get all the logistics of that. But it is Friday evening, all day Saturday on um, April 15th and 16th. So 6 to 11 on Friday, 9 a.m. to 11 p.m. on Saturday. And Saturday is going to be chock full of a lot of things. That's going to be Operation Love Lima, all of our workshops. Um, lunch and dinner will be provided then on Saturday too. Ticket prices are $60 
or if they get a group of 15 or more, they're going to be $45, so $15 off if there's a youth group going um, of uh, 15 or more. And so we're really excited, too. We have some youth groups coming from Dayton, um, West Virginia, Texas. A lot of people are hearing about this event happening mm -hmm. in Lima, Ohio, and they want to be a part of it. So we're really excited. That's mm -hmm. awesome. That is great. Tyler Buck, thank you so much for talk talking with us. We will, of course, be telling you more about this as well. Watch for the uh, public service announcements, the commercials, all the different things. Be praying for this event. Mm -hmm. Be praying for the kids who are going to come. Mm -hmm. Be praying for the kids who need to be coming. Okay. Could it be that this two-day weekend could be the spark that is necessary to light a fire into a young person's life, to be that next generation to do amazing incredible things for Christ. And you can call the Teens for Christ office. That is that Elida Road address that Tyler mentioned in case you have questions and convergemovement.com, right guys? Yep, .com mm -hmm, right. is the, uh, the website that you want to go to find out more.